What's going on everybody? Welcome back. So today we're going to be looking at the Orphic Reef Aquarium Lens. I want to show you guys what this kit comes with and a couple of new cool features. So, it comes with four lenses in this nice little carrying case, microfiber cleaner, and your actual clip. It does come with the 15K lens, which is that darker orange lens, the 20K, which is that lighter yellow, the CPL lens, which is for glares, this is the polarized lens. This is going to be really good for the top down shots and the macro lens for those super up close, super clear pictures. So let's take a look at the clip. Now you guys can see already huge diameter right here, which is going to be very crucial. So if you have a phone where the camera is really far down, you'll most likely be able to get it at any angle, get all your cameras in there. If you have multiple cameras, this is going to be really good. Also, since it is a huge diameter here now, there's nothing that's going to be up close and mess with the camera focus, and it's going to allow more light to penetrate through this lens to let your camera really work at its best. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this upstairs, and you know maybe we'll pick one or two corals, focus on that, and go through each lens and look at the difference. All right, so we're going to focus on my Roswell Landing Mushroom. This is one of my favorite corals. It has a ton of different colors in it. So right now we're looking at it under all blues with no filter at all. So first we will slide the 15K lens over it and take a look. 15K lens, when it's all blues, to me, makes the coral look true to your eye. This is what I see when I'm wearing my contacts, and it's all blues in person. So super vibrant, looks really, really good. Now let's take off the 15K and look at the coral with just the 20K. All right, so you can see here that the oranges are not as bright, the greens are not as bright. It still is a very good lens for blues. I personally think that the 20K is really good for when you go to a store or a frag swap and you have those lights that are on in the ceiling and you know it's kind of like a full spectrum look to the tank that's that's what I that's what I usually use the 20k for now what we're gonna do is we're going to stack the 20k and the 15k together and see if that makes a difference okay so when stacking both it makes everything super vibrant it really takes care of everything when you're looking at a full spectrum tank or all blues you can stack it and walk around and take videos and pictures and feel pretty confident that as you're doing that you don't need to switch lenses constantly so again this is the uh, the 20k lens that is screwed onto the clip first and then on top of that is the 15k so now what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go back to just the 15k and I'm gonna put on the macro lens and see how that looks Okay, so here's the same shot of the Roswell Landing Mushroom with the 15K and the macro lens on it. Now, macro lens is meant for really, really close-up pictures and videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it, zoom in as close as I can, focus it, and then we'll take a look at how good this macro lens is. All right, so right now I'm about zoomed in about halfway with my phone and everything looks really good. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. Okay, so now bear in mind, I don't have the best camera phone in the world, but look how close we're getting. You can really see how the little, you know, the bubbles and stuff on the mushroom are, some are like solid orange, some have a little green in them, some of them have like little smears of yellow in them. Really good looking mushroom, look at this thing the deep purple base of it with all these little orange and yellow and green bumps. Let's see if we can go over here. Oh yep, yeah, see where the look at that look at that bounce bubble on it. It's so bright. Looks pretty good. Now let's take a look at the entire tank. Okay so here we are looking at a full shot of the tank. Again this now is the 15K and 20K lens stacked on top of each other under all blues. Now what I want to do is keep the camera going and actually let's get rid of the all blues and go to full spectrum and see how everything looks. Okay so it brightens up a little bit 
And then for my tank full spectrum, I add the other lights, the T5s to it. And then what I'm going to do is make it so that it's not so bright. And there we go. This is full spectrum. Now, what I consider full spectrum with an LED T5 combo and a gel filter, it makes everything kind of dull. The sand looks nice and white. The rocks look nice and purple. Now, my tank is extremely blue under full spectrum, so if I take this off, you can see I, everything just turns blue. But when you throw this lens on, it changes things up quite a bit. So, really like this lens kit. Super impressive. So, hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave a link in the description to the Orphic Facebook group. Go check it out, see what they got going on over there, and I will see you guys on the next one. Alright, I just want to thank you guys again for stopping by. If you did like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, and while you're here, hit that little crab icon to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell for any future videos or updates, and in case you haven't seen these two videos, you might want to click on one and check it out. Again, thanks for stopping by.